Hi guys, welcome back to Articulate. Today we will be having a look at the updated version of Comic Cave 112 skill Hawk Buster from the Iron Man Age of Ultron. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. First of all, uh, in terms of skill, uh, this Hawkbuster is in 112 skill and I absolutely loving it. The skill is very very nice because uh, if you compare with uh, Hot Toys one, um, that one is in 16 skill and it is very very massive and uh, you can hardly pose him. Uh, but with this uh, Comic Cave uh, updated uh, look, they actually improve uh, a few things. Uh, on the articulation part and also the uh, overall uh, possibility is uh, slightly much more better than the uh, early release uh, version uh, back probably a year or two uh, before that so without further ado let's uh, have a look at what is actually improved uh, on this uh, Hulk Buster so let's have a look first of all uh, I would like to show you the waist part here, this is a very very impressive one as you can see uh, the original uh, Hot Buster, the waist is actually very limited this one actually does have a swivel waist it can uh, turn left and also sorry about that and also there's no issue for him to actually turn right so it is a very nice uh, possibility with this figure as you can see here the next thing about this figure is actually the uh, arms uh, the arms actually can be extended as you can see it can actually uh, move uh, quite freely slightly more than uh, the normal as you can see here you can extend and contract back very nicely the hands also is uh, you can actually rotate him and uh, this part here as usual it can it does open up as you can see this uh, section here uh, you can ex extend it up and uh, retract it back and it actually does uh, this nice uh, thing about this uh, figure is this part here it does uh, flip up very nicely and uh, you can actually have him uh, posing the arms and uh, hands no problem at all as for the uh, this shoulder and arm here it does have this uh, extended with a wide range of uh, possibility no issue at all you can have him uh, posing with his hands uh, in such a way so very nice very nice the head also the head also can be uh, posed very nicely uh, if you look at it carefully this uh, section here you can swivel left and right so if you close it up a hot buster can rotate his head so with the arms down and uh, you, as, you, as you can see it does retain the uh, gimmick here as you can see here the chest piece actually open and the head uh, inside of this figure very very impressive looking check it out absolutely stunning detail so if you compare with uh, so if you compare with uh, any 112 skill, uh, I believe uh, it, the Mark 43 is very close to what we have here uh, on my left hand side. Uh, this is the uh, Mark uh, 3 Iron Man. So the skill of it uh, is very very uh, nice. Uh, so there you have it. Iron Man Hawk Buster. Uh, together with this uh, sadly toys 
so maybe you can have a look at the uh, height comparison as you can see over here uh, Ironman Mark 3 actually comes uh, close to the waist section of uh, Hawk Buster uh, it does look very very impressive look at that so maybe I move him at the side and uh, over here I have the uh, Mark 46 also a very nice figure as you can see Mark 46 here actually is already in a very bad shape uh, because I allowed my son to play with it uh, for a while so now it actually looks like a better damage a better damage figure everything is all scratch up but still standing very nice although the joints is a bit loose now so uh, maybe I have a uh, hot buster uh, showing you the back portion of the uh, hot buster so as you can see turning in from the right hand side and this is how he looks at the back very very impressive look at that the detailing of this is very impressive look at that absolutely stunning all, all the pistons the paint application is very very well preserved so this is the switch uh, whereby you can actually have the uh, chest plate open uh, it does actually uh, light up all you need to do is pull this guy out uh, there's a pack at the bottom here so you need to slide the pack uh, at the bottom here in order to close it back so there is a switch over here and over here for the front uh, chest so maybe I have him uh, turn around and this is how it looks the chest piece and also the Mark 43 uh, helmet is also light up very very nice Look at that. Uh, to have the uh, hands like uh, light up, all you need to do is put it out, and uh, there's a switch here. So this is how it looks. Very nice. Just slot it back in. So as you can see here, uh, I have already have uh, hot master lighted up with the uh, hands on the right and the left hand side uh, next I will be showing you the uh, light up feature for the legs all you need to do is rotate it at the side just pull this guy out and uh, this is actually magnetized there's a switch down here and uh, this is the light up feature for the legs and also the back here similarly to the uh, right leg switch it on and this is how it looks very very nice at the back and also the uh, front of course uh, the bottom of the legs are also lighted up very very impressive absolutely stunning looking hawk buster the light also is uh, very bright so as you can see my uh, living here is all lighted up uh, I have uh, surrounding uh, lighting around me and uh, hot buster does still light up very very nice 
over here there's a flap you can actually move it up so no problem at all the back there's also a flap here at the back there is also a flap here so you can actually move the flap up a bit uh, to have some kind of uh, possibility for the legs very nice next uh, I just want to show this uh, depletion of the legs it does goes up and a bit of lower down from the uh, crouch here you can actually move it up no problem at all or you can extend it a little bit down the legs here this uh, knee section here actually you can actually pull it slightly longer or you can actually retract it back so as you can see at the back it does retract and extend very nicely actually you can have it uh, very close to uh, a foot height uh, which is similar to the uh, Hot Toys uh, figure but uh, in terms of articulation maybe I will be showing you some kind of uh, dynamic pose and see how Hot Buster will look right after this so first look uh, at uh, one of the poles that you can have no problem at all you can have his uh, hands uh, stretching out uh, as though hot muscle is actually uh, blasting from his hands the legs all spread out with the left uh, arm and hands uh, getting ready to blast too so uh, this is how he looks very nice next uh, I can have uh, Hot Buster actually as though he is uh, on a running pose so if you do have a hawk you can actually allocate a hawk uh, somewhere over here uh, probably uh, in uh, this uh, dynamic pose, action pose, uh, facing Hawk Buster, uh, that will be very nice. Uh, of course, the legs is also very stable, as you can see here. No problem at all. Very nice. Hawk Buster in this uh, leaping, running. Pose. Of course, the, the last pose uh, is this uh, uh, armored all open up, uh, showing the uh, versatility of uh, this uh, Iron Man suit together with the uh, one's, one's uh, 12 skew on my left and right. Uh, by showing off uh, all the uh, opening openable panels Hotbuster is looking very very impressive look at that absolutely stunning so uh, after this uh, I will be getting the uh, uh, Iron Man Striker and also I believe uh, Ego uh, from Comic Cave and uh, I will also include the Mark 5, Mark 6 and Mark 7 uh, hopefully I will be able to get the uh, Mark 1 also in one chair skill and uh, that will complete my uh, Iron Man uh, collection so I won't be, I won't be collecting any more uh, than that uh, few figures so there you have it uh, i hope you guys enjoy the video until then articulate signing off
remember to share, subscribe and spread the love. See you guys next time.